Hi, this is Miss D. Welcome back to our 2017 Julie Nutting um, Doll Stamp Collaboration. It's hosted by Terry E01, uh, Don, who is Dare to Be Creative, and myself, D. Special Things. Okay, you guys, this month our theme is Valentine's or Hearts. And our prompt is envelopes. You can use that prompt any way you feel like it. You can incorporate envelopes on your project. You can make your, um, uh, your project using envelopes. Whatever idea you come up with, um, with the prompt, uh, the theme, Valentine's or hearts or love, any of that, and your prompt, which is envelopes. The first one I did... And for this one, I actually use the We Are Memory Keepers frame board. Now, I'm going to have to actually do a video, a little tutorial on this because I did not do one yet. But this is my project, as you can see. And what I did was I used all of the little embellies and such that's on it, with the exception of the little beads in there. These are actually the um, embellishments from the Target dollar spot. Uh, what, bullseye? Is that what they call it now? Yeah, and the little shakers. I couldn't get this to not stick around the corners. That's why I'll show you how I use my frame it punch board to make these and then I'll show you a better way of making it I know right well I'll show you now because I have another project that I did making it because I couldn't get the tape that I used it kept sticking my little embellishments my seed beads and stuff in there so I decided to do it without the tape but yeah and what makes it so shaky is I actually ran across these little things and they're pellets. Matter of fact, let me show you. They are the poly pellets and I know if you all are crafting, you all have this because I was cleaning my craft room and I found these in my craft room. They're called the poly pellets. I think, I know they still sell them in the craft stores if you check Michael's Joy's or whatever. You put these in your blankets or your, your bean bags or your, your dolls and stuff in it. It gives them weight. It makes It's like the polyfill, but it makes them heavy. Yeah, so that's actually what I used. And I was like, oh my goodness, why didn't I think of that? But the only reason I thought of it is because I was cleaning up and I came across it. So I decided to give it a try. And it actually works. And it's a color where where you can use it with any color so yeah I wonder if you could dye these I bet you can I bet you can with some alcohol ink or something yeah so there you are for my first project and of course like I said we had to use the prompt envelope so on these projects I actually put the envelopes on the projects. I have some more projects that I'll probably do for you before this weekend. I just didn't have time because ooh, when I tell you I had one hell of a weekend. It started Thursday. Yeah. Yes, I did. But here you are for this one. It's a shaker and I used, like I said, my We Are Memory Keepers um, Frame It Board Punch. Yeah. And then this one is another one you could call it a flip book if you want or you can just call it a shaker it shakes yeah and there you are yes so it is i actually use this um these are my envelopes here i traced the little envelopes that i got from the target dollar spot so that it would match yeah, so there you are. I used some, I don't know if these are Wild Orchid Crafts or I Am Roses Flowers, but yeah, these are the Target Dollar Spot Hearts, all of them. Yeah, the teeny ones, the these, the gold ones, the pink ones, yeah. And I think this is a Spellbinders die. I'm not certain, so yeah, and then here and here. I'm not sure, but it could be, but that is the front of it. 
and I put the two hearts there, used the Julie Nutting doll, used another Julie Nutting doll, and put a little sentiment there that said, Friends of Special Treasures of the Heart, with a bunch of hearts there. And then on this one, I just put a picture of her with the little frame, and I don't know where this frame comes from, but I trimmed this in gold. This is, this shaker is used with just scored paper. Yeah, so that way, the, I just scored the paper. But I did use the little pellets in there because, I'm going to close it, it shakes a lot better. Yeah, so, um, yeah, and then the hearts, the little hearts from the Target dollar spot. And these hearts I actually punch with my little punch thing. But there you are. And for my last project today because I think I'm going to actually if I get a chance to craft today I am going to try to do some more of these I like I like Julie Nutting okay here I just used all of her faces I actually cut the dolls out did the faces there are my envelopes I know you didn't have to just use envelopes you could have actually used an envelope to make the project I'm going to show you that if I get a chance to do it again today but, oh, did I say, you all, I'm sorry if I didn't say, um, we have lots of collaborators, so you might want to go check their videos out. I don't know if I said that, but they are a great bunch of creative, crafty people, and I'm, I'm liking that we did this because everyone has so many great ideas about using these Julie Nutting dolls, and um, if you look in the description box below, everyone will be, everyone's name is there. So just in case I didn't say that up front, everyone's link to their channel is there. If by chance the link does not work, all you have to do is go put their name in and it should pop up. Um, yeah, but this is the project that I did and I just used their faces. All of the little embellishments that I use. I use some twine. The twine is from Michael's. Yeah. Um, I think it's their, what's, you know, their brand twine. Um, the envelopes are just some envelopes that I actually cut out and put on there. And they have the little hearts there. And I put love notes there and my besties. These are my besties. I like these. I like the Julie Nutting dolls. So yeah, I decided to do that. The frame that I have them in is the Seven Gypsy Shadow Box cover. Yeah, this has a box to go to it, but I wanted to use it this way. And I'll probably put a, a dangle or something on here so that I could hang them up. Yeah, but this is pretty much what I made. These are my three projects. All right, everyone, if you want to join us, just put, if you do a project, just put the name, the title of our collaboration in your title, and your videos should pop up. But, yes, it's the uh, 2017 Julie Nutting Doll Stamp Collaboration, February 2017. Or you could just put February. But yeah, this is the collaboration. I appreciate everyone that's playing along with us. I'm getting a whole lot of ideas. Having a whole lot of fun. I really appreciate you all. Thank you for watching. And I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.